The issue was raised by Hawaii Senator Brian Schatz to Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin during a U.S. Senate Defense Appropriations Subcommittee hearing on Tuesday. Admiral Aquilino's posture plans for the Indo-Pacific rely at least in part on maintaining access to compact states, Micronesia, the Marshall Islands, and Palau. Um, can you talk about uh, the importance of these compact states to DOD's uh, mission in the Pacific? They're very important. Uh, we we uh, always aim to be the partner of choice, and uh, and I think our continued engagement with them uh, will will certainly result in uh, additional uh, capability and capacity uh, as we go forward. Last month, President Biden appointed a well-respected career diplomat, Ambassador Joseph Yoon, as the new special presidential envoy for the compact renewal talks. It underscored the view that the continued relationship with Micronesian countries is a critical national security and geopolitical imperative. And Schatz maintains that the Defense Department needs a seat at the table, too. To a certain extent, although you're a silent partner in the in terms of the nuts and bolts of the negotiation you're you're the biggest deal in the negotiation so what i'd like you to consider is uh, appointing someone specifically to be in the room for even the preliminary negotiations again states got a lead on this but having dod at the table makes an enormous difference uh, for compact states in terms of conveying to these compact states how important they are uh, 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 to us Secretary Blinken and I are great partners, and uh, and certainly uh, I'm, I'm sure that uh, this this will be what uh, he will want to see as well. And we will continue to work with the entire interagency to make sure that we're in the right place here. So. Great. Thank you. The Compacts of Free Association with the Federated States of Micronesia and the Marshall Islands expire at the end of next year and with the Republic of Palau in 2024. For KUAM News, I'm Nestor Lakanto.